Annabelle It was many and many a year ago in a kingdom by the sea that a maiden there lived whom you may well know by the name Annabelle And this maiden, she lived with no other thought than to love and be loved by me. I was a child, and she was a child in this kingdom by the sea. But we loved with a love that was more than love. I am my Annabelle Lee, with a love that the winged seraphs of heaven coveted her and me. And this was the reason that long ago, in the kingdom by the sea, a wind blew out of the cloud, chilling my beautiful Annabelle, so that her high-born kinsmen came and bore her away from me to shut her up in a sepulchre in the kingdom by the sea. The angels, not half so happy in heaven, went envying her and me. Yes, that was the reason, as all men know, in this kingdom by the sea, that the wind came out of a cloud by night, chilling and killing by Annabelle Lee. But our love it was stronger by far than the love of those who were older than we, of many far wiser than we. And neither the angels in heaven above, nor the demons down under the sea, can ever dissever my soul from the soul of the beautiful Annabelle. For the moon never beams without bringing me dreams of the beautiful Annabelle. And the stars never rise, but I feel the bright eyes of the beautiful Annabelle Lee. And so, all the night tide, I lie down by the side of my darling, my darling, my life, and my bride, in the sepulchre, there by the sea, in her tomb, by the surrounding 